Hi friends, this is Shekhar Srinivasan, Microsoft Certified Trainer and a .NET Architect. In this video, we shall understand how to work with responsive images in Bootstrap 3. We shall understand how to make an image as a responsive so that it can scale automatically based on the device width. And also we shall understand how to prepare a thumbnail rounded corner and circle for the image content once we understand that we also understand how to make a responsive embedded object that is whenever we use a video or we use a iframe object or embed element on a form how to make it responsive now let's try to understand this practically with a demo I already opened my visualstudio.net and made my solution ready for supporting the bootstrap. Now let's try to add a web form. And let's try to add the support for the bootstrap. And once I just added the style sheet, let's try to understand what is the concept of responsiveness. To understand this, let me just try to prepare some simple layout. I just specify a container where I take a row in this row what I do is I would like to take two columns of six width let me try to place some images within this I take one more div class equal to column md6 in order to understand the bootstrap grid system you can just watch the bootstrap grid system video from my youtube channel now once i just place it let me try to execute and observe it how this is going to display it for me there are two images i said call six so this is going to display the first part of the image and the second part of the image has been exactly started in the off and you can just try to observe it this is the image which is getting shown and all and you can just try to observe here uh, the first half of the image is not it's been overlapped it's not displaying properly so my requirement is I wanted to make it responsive so in order to make your uh, images to be responsive what we have to do is simply we need to add a class with a name called this image responsive I just try to add the class image responsive for these two elements let's try to execute now once again we can just try to observe here both the images has been displayed since I said call MD6 as the value we can just try to observe it the first six column has been taken by the first image the next six column has been taken by the next image now if I try to make it as small it will come one after the other and this is going to be in a responsive style for us okay so you can just try to observe it the images are going to get this in this way we can just make an image as a responsive now along with responsiveness we also have a support for preparing some kind of uh, thumbnails for the images so to understand this what I can do is let me take one more row and uh, I try to take a class called md4 I just specify so that we can just try to have three columns here I place a image here now let me just try to have the same copy three times so we can just try to observe now I just made a row with three column width with three images that I have just specified we can just try to observe it these are the three images what we have now I just wanted to add some kind of bootstrap styles that are going to be given so bootstrap supports three styles for the images one is image circle the other one is going to be image rounded and the third one is going to be image thumbnail 
when you try to add this particular classes for the image and if you try to execute it we can just try to observe how the images are going to be displayed so when i say image circle you can see that the image has been displayed within the circle and when i say image rounded you can see that the corners of this image has been rounded and when you say a thumbnail you can see a border has been attached for this image so we have a support for making an image as a responsive image and also we have a provision given for making your content to be added as a thumb sizes not only for the images bootstrap also provides a responsive support for the media objects that can be embedded with the support of div tags or uh, with the support of embed or iframes etc to understand this particular thing what i try to do is let me just try to copy a media element which i wanted to use it let me go for my youtube channel and quickly grab some source code which is required for me let's say this is a video i just go and grab the embed objects that is available so embed and i just copy this particular iframe okay i just copied the iframe now let's try to place this thing i try to take a div tag within this i place this iframe and let me try to execute this once i make this particular thing to be executing we can see that the media element will be added now when i try to reduce the screen size since i have bootstrapped it with the proper things we can see that the images are becoming responsive and the sizes has been getting decreased and we can just view the things properly where is this particular media element what you have is it's not responsive you have to scroll this particular thing when you wanted to make your media element also to be responsive okay if you wanted to make this particular media element also to be a responsive then what we can do is simply we need to add a class saying that embed responsive and there is a support for aspect ratio also you have a aspect ratio of 16 by 9 and 4 by 3 you can specify the aspect ratio in which this particular element has to be displayed now let me just try to execute once again to observe the things so i'm just trying to use a full screen so we can see that the content is been displayed to the full screen now let me just try to uh, reduce the sizes and we can just try to observe now there is a small difference in the media element this is getting resized according to the size of the screen so in this way what you can do is you can make your content to be more responsive hope you are clear with how to make your content as responsive with the support of bootstrap 3 thank you if you like this video please subscribe to my youtube channel this encourages me to develop more and more videos thank you yours shaker